Welcome back, everyone, to our channel, TechZone. The founder and CEO of SpaceX, Elon Musk has revealed his plans to colonize the nearby planet, Mars. In today's video, we will find out more about Musk's plans of colonizing Mars. In a series of tweets, Musk talked about how humans will initially colonize the Red Planet. Musk explained that in order to colonize Mars, we would first have to support life in glass domes before terraforming Mars to support life like Earth. Musk has shared his dream of making humans a multiplanetary species while building the first colony on Mars by 2050. To make the planet more habitable for humans, Musk has proposed the process known as terraforming, which involves bombarding the planet with nuclear weapons at its poles to melt ice sheets. The process will induce accelerated warming on the planet to make it more habitable for humans. Elon first proposed terraforming as a likely solution to accelerate the habitability of Mars in 2014, when he described it as a top of a planet lifter in an interview with American TV host Stephen Colbert. Musk disclosed his plans to build a city on Mars at a live broadcast event last month. He stressed the idea that a Martian colony would be completely self-sufficient in the event, just in case if support from Earth becomes disrupted. When it comes to home planets, Earth ticks most of the boxes. It has oxygen, water, food, and everything that is essential for life. But there are also risks that need to be taken into account. What if a nuclear war, asteroid collision, or dishonest AI blew up the smoke, obliterating our fragile existence? Luckily, Elon Musk is one step ahead and last year outlined his ambition to send humans to Mars as a backup drive for civilization. Now the billionaire entrepreneur has provided further details of his vision to make humans a multiplanetary species in a breezy paper published in the appropriately titled Journal New Space. Fortunately, Elon Musk is one step ahead in last year. He described his ambition to send humans to Mars as a backup plan for civilization. Now, the billionaire businessman has given more details on his vision of making humans a multiplanetary species. Musk has revealed the designs of the gigantic spacecraft, which is designed to carry 100 passengers, after being designed flawlessly. The core level of Mars is enormous, as Musk's team is planning to lift off the core of 13,000 tons, while making it quite tectonic during its takeoff. The ultimate goal of creating a fully self-sustained civilization of around 1 million people would take more than 50 years. Musk needs to entice the first pioneers to pave the way if he is wishing to colonize Mars for every human being on Earth. Now the question is what is the timescale for the project? Musk has explained that he is intentionally confused about when the vision could come true, though the company is predicting their first flight to begin in 2023. If things are going very well, it could be 10 years from now, but it's still not clear when that will happen. Musk also shared his thoughts for what he thinks governance on Mars might look like. Musk said he imagines Mars will have direct democracy instead of the government system of the United States. Musk has urged future settlers to keep the laws short so that people can easily read and absorb the opinions before voting. He warned that long laws can turn out fishy on Mars. However, Musk is less specific about the expenditure as who would pay for the journey, saying it would be a great public-private partnership and that he hoped the support would be like a snowball. He said the cost per person would need to drop significantly for colonization to work. Right now, Musk estimates that a trip to Mars would cost $10 billion per person. Musk says he would like to reduce the cost to around $200,000. While these all things are going on, many people have opposed plans of Elon Musk to colonize the Red Planet. Ellen Stoffen, the NASA chief scientist, has admitted that there can never be a mass transfer of humans to another planet. He also added that the plan of colonizing Mars is giving rise to a distraction from the problems faced on our home planet. He further added that there can't be a planet B other than our own planet. We can't transfer humans to Mars, so we should try to bring some changesments in our civilization. While many others have also claimed that instead of making humans a multiplanetary species, we should try to make Earth a more sustainable multi-species planet before we go on to colonize the solar system. Colonization of Mars would require a wide variety of equipment 
to provide services directly to humans, while some other manufacturing appliances to produce food, water, energy, and breathable oxygen to support human colonization on Mars. Well, we all know that Elon Musk is known for doing miracles. Let's see what more he adds in his plans to colonize Mars. What are your thoughts on Elon Musk's plans of colonizing Mars? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.